Hi, I'm Tammy Claybo. Last month, I had the privilege of sharing my story. At the end, I mentioned that I was heading back to Duke for my checkup in hopes of being able to be put on a heart transplant. Well, let me give you a little update. I go to Duke every three months for, an annual, for my checkup, and every year I have to do a specialized test, and that test determines um, whether it's necessary to consider a heart transplant. There are two numbers that they consider. One number needs to be higher than 14, and the other one needs to be lower than 35. Well, last year my numbers were 13 and 37, which meant it was time to consider being put on the transplant list. This year was very different. After having completed the test, I went in to see the doctor and he came and shared my numbers with me. The number that was supposed to be higher than 14 was actually 17.6, and at 18, you're considered not a risk. And the number that was supposed to be 37 was only 31. Now that's pretty much amazing. The doctor said God is good, and that maybe my numbers last year were bad in order for us to be able to discover the hepatitis C, because if we wouldn't have discovered it until I started having problems, we would have been in a bad way. My numbers being so good, now it's not even necessary to con be considered for a heart transplant. Wow, something that seemed so devastating just a year ago, God has turned around and shown himself more than faithful. The news is better than I could have ever imagined, but in God's word in Ephesians 3.20, it says that he is able to do abundantly, exceedingly more than we can ever hope or imagine. And he's done just that for me. I pray that you'll continue to pray for my family and me and that you'll remember that he is faithful.